Hey Capricorns, this is your weekend check-in. The first card we got was the Nine of Cups. So someone desires something very strongly. Someone is desiring or wanting something to take place. It was clarified by the Nine of... Or Nine. <laughs> Y'all, ooh, Nine of Pentacles, that's a good thing. It was clarified by the Page of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands. So yes, someone could be, be very attracted to you. They want to talk to you, but I feel like a guard is up or you could be protecting yourself, being very defensive. Some of you have actually blocked this person uh, from communicating with you or you've put a, a stop to communication, okay? The next card we got was the death card, Scorpio energy. So I was feeling very strongly like something has ended or uh, something is about to end between you and this person. Something is ending with the with the death card. And it was clarified by the nine of swords and the five of cups. The number nine could be very significant to you uh, at this time. So it's like with the nine of swords and the five of cups, this is stressing someone out or maybe in the past because five of cups represents past energy. Maybe in the past, this has been a very stressful situation. It was on your mind a lot. It could have been on their mind a lot. There's a lot of regrets here. It's like uh, someone wants to say they're sorry. They regret putting you in a stressful situation. The last card we got was the hanging man. Okay, Pisces energy. So again, someone is like all tied up, tangled up in something. Uh, someone is stuck could be stuck in their thoughts, stuck in, stuck in their head. I clarified this energy twice. So we have two sets of cards here. I clarified it and I got the strength card and the justice card, two major arcanas. We have Leo and Libra. Okay. You could be dealing with a Leo or a Libra or someone has that in their chart, but it's like someone is struggling with a separation someone is struggling with a divorce still stuck inside of a marriage um they could be going through all kind of legalities it doesn't have to be a relationship they could be going through something where they're dealing with court fees court documents could be having child support issues or problems okay something with the judicial system that they're dealing with and then those cards were clarified by the hermit and the seven of pentacles so it's like, I feel like ugh, this person is having to wait or they've been having to wait for a while for something to come through, something to happen with that hermit energy. This person is still in hermit mode, having to figure things out. It's been a long time, could have been seven years, seven weeks, seven months, something like that with the number seven or with the number nine that came out strongly. Something has been going on for a long time and I feel like this person... Um, I'm being drawn to how this person looks tattered. Their clothes look tattered. Uh, this could be a situation that has really stressed this person out or they've gone through a rough time financially with the seven of pentacles coming out, uh, signifying money, maybe money being spent on things. This person could be struggling through a lot right now and they're growing old. They're going, growing stressed out as well. The advice cards here was retreat and let go of control issues. Okay. I feel like the two of you, I'm being drawn to these two people on the card, like walking away into a wooded area. Maybe the two of you need to get away and talk about things or uh, you're choosing to retreat from the situation. Okay. Also let go of control issues, allow the situation to unfold naturally. It may be very hard to do that at this point, but someone needs to let go of trying to control the situation or trying to control the narrative. Forgiveness was the advice card from the angels deck. Forgiveness needs to happen. Okay. Someone needs to forgive the other person or forgive the situation for things to come back together. Also be assertive was at the bottom of the deck. Be assertive and let this person know how you feel or what's going on or they need to be assertive with you. All right, Capricorns, that is your energy for this weekend. Don't forget to like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Also, share this video and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monetero. I look forward to hearing from you. Take care. Bye.